adding additional navigation bars. Here at the Google site, you can see that we have a navigation bar that begins here on the left-hand side and an additional one. Well, the question is, how do we get that additional navigation bar on there? Let's take a look at the process. We go to Edit Sidebar at the very bottom here, and we'll immediately come up to our sidebar uh, area. We have the first navigation bar and the second navigation bar. Now, don't be fooled here. If we go to the Edit, we can see the actual name of the navigation bar typed in here. Unfortunately, it doesn't show in the settings area. We will close that. So if we'd like, we can go down here and we can add a sidebar item. And we have a number of sidebars that we can add here. And we'll just scroll down through them and we find navigation bar. So if we click on navigation bar, a third one shows up right down here, right below the countdown. And we can move it back up above the countdown by simply clicking on the bar here and dragging it to whatever alignment that we want. And we can go ahead and save changes and return back to our site. And we should find another navigation bar that exists on our page. We can start adding pages to that navigation bar as we uh, showed you in earlier videos simply by clicking Edit Navigation Bar. We can click on the edit of that navigation bar. We can even give it a name. We'll call this sample nav bar just so you can see the change. And we can come down and add pages to it. And it's a list of pages that we have been working on and creating in this tutorial. So let's just click on team members even though it exists in another one. And we'll say OK. And we are going to say OK to that and save changes to our site. So it has been changed and let's go back and take a look at what we've done. Sure enough, we've changed the name of the navigation bar and we've added a page to it. Well, to remove those navigation bars, it's as simple as putting them on. Let's go back to the edit navigation bar and we have our third navigation bar here. All we have to do is click on delete. It removes it from our page. Click on save and let's return and see what that looks like at our site. There we go. That is adding an additional navigation bar to your site.